Hi everyone, this is Cheryl Bliss with Consistently Creative Croppers and I wanted to share with you a little quick video on how to create this cute little sun that I made here in this layout using the Zebra Stripe Border Maker cartridge. You're gonna start off with the smallest circle from the custom cutting system. I have this piece of paper that was from Endless Meadows you could also use this um, paper, would be really pretty. This is from Serene Waters. That would also be pretty for your son. A um, mottled color I think is really nice. So we're gonna take the red blade and we're just gonna quickly cut a little um, circle. And there's our circle. And the next step is to cut a border with the zebra border maker cartridge. So this piece of paper on the back side, this is from Serene Waters, it has um, some stripes already on there, so that's what we're gonna use for our sun rays. So I'm just gonna quickly cut a little border with the zebra stripe. People have been doing lots of fun things with this uh, zebra stripe, namely the um, making bacon with it. So a bunch of people have been making some bacon pages, which is kind of fun. All right, so the little trick on this, there's just a couple of little tricks, but one of them is I'm gonna cut the edges and I wanna use my Victorian blade to give a jagged edge. So the little sun rays are um, little different sizes. So I'm gonna put this in my trimmer and when I cut this, I want this edge to be the jagged edge. So here's our little rays. And the trick to get it to go around the circle is to just cut every few, um, just cut with your micro tip scissors, every few, sorry, I hear my puppy in the background, but every few little um, rays, I guess we would call it since we're making a sun out of this because this will uh, bend around our circle that we're doing if we just slice in there a little bit every few. And the this size circle works perfectly. So we're going to take our repositionable tape runner and just go around the circle kind of close to the edge because we want the um, this is where we're going to attach. I hope you can see that. And so obviously this is the opposite side of the paper. And you're just gonna place that just to the inside of the circle and then I'll be bending this as I go around. And where we sliced here, you'll see that that's where the little, it makes it easier to put it around. Okay, so we're just gonna go around the edge here and this is gonna make our nice little sun shape. I hope we can see that. And then the little sun rays are gonna be sticking out. And you don't have to be too fussy about it, but kinda of close to the edge. I'm just tucking that in there. And then this, this size circle works perfectly. It's just the right amount. And then maybe there's one extra one that I'll cut off. So that's sort of doubled up right there. But there's the little sunshine. How easy is that? Now on the layout that I did here, I cut it in half. And I'm gonna do another quick video to show you how to do this layout. This was um, bonus number four. So anyway, on this one, I just cut it in half um, and used it right here. So I have another half that I can use on another page, but just wanted to share that with you. And I'm gonna do another um, quick video to show you how to do this layout. Thanks for watching, everyone.